Hello, hello, hello. So, we're going to actually we're going to run through and do the zodiac sign. And we're going to actually start with the Pisces. Because the last shall be first. <laughs> okay. We're going to see what's going down with the Pisces. Let's see what decks am I drawn to for the good old Pisces. Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. I've been seeing too a lot of Pisces flack. <laughs> a lot of people don't like the Pis Pis. That's all right, though. Because the Pisces is love. Okay? And we love anyway. Despite people talking stuff. Okay, we're going to start off with the zodiac sign Pisces. Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. That beautiful, beautiful Pisces that I see a lot of people try to attack because the Pisces can be sensitive. Cause they super in tune you know with their emotions and people like to talk a lot of stuff about the Pisces but the Pisces is everybody in one every zodiac sign in one so when people be talking about the Pisces and all that negative Everything has, every sign has its negative and its positive, but they be going kind of hard, but it's like, you know, they be talking about themselves. And that's also the energy that I'm getting to. I think that's why I'm even saying that. <laughs> because Pisces, it seems like people are saying things about you and talking about you but they're really talking about themselves I'm getting people are making up lies I'm getting people making up lies I'm getting people making up lies and what do you know? You popping up right in your read in the first. We got meditate and contemplate. New moon in Pisces. Okay? So you need to meditate and contemplate. Go within. Because um, you could probably feel all of that negative energy and people speaking ill and everything. So, um... And especially if you're very in tune with your emotional side too as well, that can probably, um, you have to ground yourself and meditate and contemplate so that that doesn't get to you, okay?
because you could be taking on how other people are feeling and, that, and it's, that's not that's not you yeah we have here a personal issue reaches resolution okay and the answers you need the answers that you need are coming okay so okay this could be an issue for you too as well okay or you could be going through something at the moment uh, as well and the answers that you need are going to come forth for you we have full moon in gemini full moon in cancer here uh, so you can have cancer in gemini highly aspected within your chart so go um, and check your chart and check that out um, I'm also seeing you have like two sides to you okay like a positive and a negative side which we all do but it's just calling out to me this Pisces in the Gemini card um, because you know you see the two fists and you see the two the two women okay representing the gemini and then you got the two fish too as well okay so you may have an extreme two sides here to you okay and with this cancer moon here i'm showing you you are very highly intuitive as well we got for our Pisces babies what else for our Pisces babies can we get some sacred ancient messages for our Pisces babies okay we got travel make plans time to move on okay so you may be wanting to move or um or you may be just wanting to move on from all of the negativity and conflict and like i said i'm sensing um i'm sensing um you know people gossiping and saying things about you and speaking on you um as well so yeah we have travel here make plans time to move on so it's time for you to move on from that um and do the thing so that it will not affect you so continue to meditate and contemplate and and ground yourself um always because okay the enemy is always trying to attack and then we have growth okay so you're growing okay do not give up you have come so far so, like I said, people may be projecting on you um, and also with your negative side within yourself. Um, that can also be attacking you as well. Because even though we have, um, I don't really even, I'm going to just say enemies or having people that don't that dislike you on the outside you still have your own enemy within you you still have your own enemy within yourself too as well so that could be another you know reason why you need to meditate and um contemplate on you know what you're feeling and what you're going through to process things correctly uh because that's a lot to handle with yourself as well as outside so outside influences too as well so yeah so you're growing okay uh and just keep going okay we have libra here libra energy you can have a libra within your chart too as well and that talks about balancing the scales okay it could be some type of partnership coming up soulmate did come out uh you are in union with your soulmate or you will soon be in union with the soulmate that you're going to partner up with okay also you could be very fashionable here too let's see okay 
Yeah, we have um, Scorpio. That could be within your chart too as well. Um, you could be very mysterious and intimidating and this is why um, people may, you know, talk. I'm seeing you're very fierce, okay? And you're very mysterious, so this is this could be why people uh, could be saying certain things and making up things about you and talking and spewing negativity because of what they don't know. And you know, normally sometimes when people don't know certain things, they try to seek to destroy what they don't understand. And then we have guidance here. Okay, so you can give guidance, okay? It's time for you to be the light, okay? And it's a bunch of lanterns, okay? It's time for you to be the light and show. Um, you can light your own way or light the way for others. dig into some um personal power messages here okay we have gemini again so yeah that really could be very highly aspected within your chart uh, it says here i am connected okay so you are connected to all things We have here, I am a healer. So, yeah, you're very, very powerful. Um, you're very, very powerful. And then you see on this I am a healer card, um, she's holding her hands right over her heart. So, you may have had to do some healing, too, as well, within yourself. Um, I'm seeing that you are aligned, to here. Uh, all your shoppers, I see you're in balance. Um, but with her holding this heart, um, definitely work on your heart chakra. Um, and listen to your heart. Follow your heart. Okay? And then I'm seeing this rainbow too. So you could have a rainbow aura or... You can see uh, rainbows, or you could have been seeing a lot of rainbows a lot lately. Okay, I just want to bring this up about this Gemini card again, okay? There's a lot of, like, little spirals here. And within the little spirals, we have um, a bell, okay? We have uh, a magnifying glass. We have male and female. So you have a nice balance between your masculine and feminine side. Uh, we have a heart. So I'm seeing you're emotionally connected and emotionally intelligent here. Okay, we have a communication bubble. So I see you, you communicate well too. And then this looked like a little, uh, in, in, we got an envelope. So I'm seeing that you are a messenger. And then right here in this bubble, it looks like uh, the Wi-Fi signal. Okay. So you can give off. Woo. So you radiate light. And you have a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful aura about you. Okay, it says here, I am open to receive. Okay, and then you see she, she got uh, these dots going down her um, forehead. I just keep hearing alignment, alignment, alignment. So you are aligned. 
and open to receive um and open to receive the messages and love and the blessings um very beautiful like i said you are very very beautiful um You could have purple hair, because purple hair is in this Gemini card, this I am beautiful card, and it's rainbow hair within the I am healer card, but it's purple right at the top, uh, and purple signifies royalty, so you could be very royal. Um, it says here, I am happy, so I'm seeing that you are happy, um, and you worked hard to be happy, okay? You can have um, natural hair. Uh, it could be curly. Um, you could be plus size. You could be uh, slim thick. You can be um, skinny too as well. But just know no matter what size you are, you are very, very beautiful. You can have freckles. You can have dimples. Or you can have like high cheekbones. You can have a beauty mark, too, as well, on your face. It says here, I tune out negative people and thoughts, okay? She's just sipping on her little drink, listening to her music, minding her business, um, and like I said, you had to meditate and get grounded and things of that nature because people were projecting onto you what they actually are. So here, that's why you had to tune out these negative thoughts in these people and all of that gossip. Okay, we're going to get a letter to you, Pisces. We're going to get a letter to you. Can we get a letter addressed to the Pisces, please? A letter addressed to the Pisces. And what do you know? Purple. <laughs> we have here, dear you, you are blessed. You are here for a reason. You have purpose. You have a destiny to fulfill. Focus and always show gratitude, okay? So, yeah, you, you, um, you're definitely very important. You definitely have a purpose here. I'm seeing you're very connected. Um, I'm also seeing fairness and justice. I'm seeing you're very intuitive, so you could be psychic and have those powers. I'm seeing you are also a healer um Scorpio that signifies transformation you could have transformed here we have another purple we have here dear you no more looking back in the past it cannot change you must learn from it and grow so you can become more powerful your old life must end you no longer want it you want need uh and crave a new one no matter what it takes push forward baby so no matter what it takes, just keep going forward. Uh, don't worry about the mistakes you made in the past. Don't worry about these gossiping people. Um, don't worry about the things that you have went through either. Take the lesson from it and push forward, okay? Because there's so much more to learn uh, too as well. And you can't uh, pile up everything, okay? And I'm seeing here, you're definitely big blessed, okay? And it looks like you got a job to do here. Can we get one more letter for the Pisces, please? One more letter, please. Okay, that's more than one. Okay, they gave us a couple. 
Okay? So we have here, if you heal, you can help others. Isn't that a precious gift to have? Isn't it? Do the work. It will make where you live a better place. Um, so, you are a healer. Okay? And you had to heal yourself first in order to be able to help people and guide them. You had to do the work first. Um, and then you had, and you got this gift, okay? So it is a gift that you're psychic and intuitive and able to help people and able to heal people and also able to connect. Uh, that is a blessing that uh, not many people are able to um, have. Um, also, where it say by you healing, it'll make where you live a better place. Um, when you heal, um, and when you focus on yourself and you heal yourself, it not only, you not only heal you, but you can spark something within those around you. And I also want to say uh, where it says it will make where you live um, a better place. Just within yourself, because you're with you all the time. You are your home. So, excuse me. So, um, it'll make things better for you as well. Sorry, I'm itching like a mug, okay? And then we have here, dear you, do not pretend to be okay. There's no need. Um, there's no need. We know you need a savior. And Yahweh will do just that. Through him you will rise and save yourself and uh, and save yourself. Seek the one, become one. Okay? So yeah, you um you had to go to the most high for this uh deep healing, okay? And if you haven't healed yet, connect with the most high, okay? Yahshua um is your savior. Okay, um, and in him and in Yahweh's love, you will rise, okay, uh, and you will be able to get the strength to, um, save yourself, um, and become more powerful within you, okay, so seek him and become one with him, okay, and then we have here, dear you, true beauty. Do you know how truly beautiful and amazing you are? You are so, so, so much more than you think. You must believe this. Open your eyes, love. Okay? So open your eyes to your own beauty as well. Okay? Uh, the world is going to see your beauty. Um, or those around you are going to see your beauty. But it's most important to open up to your true beauty of yourself. And know that... You are beautiful first, and also believe that, that you are beautiful first, okay? Okay, we're going to get... get some F it up cis messages and it could be cis or bro it does not matter okay it says here I ain't gotta be perfect I just gotta show up I commit to always showing up for myself okay so things don't have to be always picture perfect you don't always have to be uh, this picture perfect or whatever the case may be but still move Still do what you got to do. Um, again, still show up for yourself and for the things that you love and for the things that you want. Okay? Okay, we have here, I shine. That's it. That's the affirmation. So, listen... You shining bright. It says here, I don't care. <laughs> Listen, 
I'm telling you it all, it really all be lining up. And I swear I had that feeling of people talking stuff and even negative thoughts within yourself. Like I had said earlier, back in this, uh, this read, okay, tuning out negative people and thoughts because yourself, you can also bring those negative thoughts to you. But there's also people that's yappity yapping. It says here, I don't care what they talking about over there. Because over here, I'm good always, okay? And that, you know, we have a lot of purple here, okay? So you definitely are royalty. Um, you can wear purple, pink a lot. Blue can be very significant too as well. Um, teal. Um, and yellow. Uh, or you may want to wear some of those colors. Do some more bright colors, more rainbow colors. Show that bright, bright, beautiful spirit off, baby. Um, but, yeah. Just know that no matter what, you can definitely tune those people out. Um, and even your own thoughts as well. Um, but remain in this energy. Don't care what other people are talking about because that ain't that ain't got nothing to do with you for real. It got everything to do with them and their insecurities and things about themselves, okay? And they're just trying to uh, project that on to you, okay? But you must remember to meditate and contemplate so that you can stay grounded and let that stuff bounce right off of you, okay? Okay, just know that you you are always good anyway. Okay, we're going to pull some love oracle cards too, um, because I see here you do have a soulmate here or a partnership uh, that could be coming up. Okay, so, and this is so crazy because <laughs> look at the bottom, we got soulmate here. At the bottom of the deck it says here, your soulmate is already with you in spirit. Believe this and they will, and they will appear and manifest physically, okay? And then we have here, Twin Flames, your passion ignites, okay? So this could be a high-level soulmate here, too, as well, that is on your path, okay? Uh, you two will bring each other peace, okay, as well. And we also have this flower here, so you all will grow together. And then you can see this white dove bird, so you all will bring each other peace and love, okay? Um... And also, I just want to point out, you both will, you both will be awakened. You see the, the, the white dot that seem like fire in the middle of both of their, uh, foreheads, like, um, two twins. So you both will be awakened. Uh, you both are earth angels too, as well. Uh, and there's a lot of love within this connection. We have here, the past is now behind you. Release it and embrace new possibilities. A new path is now available to you. Follow it with faith. Okay? Um, I know it was something about... Let's see. Yeah. This letter right here. Uh, about not looking back within the past. Because that old life and you want a new life. Okay? So it's time to just look forward. Keep going forward. Embrace all that you have learned from your past, okay, but now you have, um, a new path, um, a new path, um, a new journey, okay, and you just have to have that faith to follow it, it says here, wait, wait, it says don't rush into it, allow nature to take its course, so, when you do come uh, into union or, you know, you do meet your soulmate, uh, don't rush things. You know, take things slow. Uh, get to know each other. Have conversations. Okay? Connect deeply. Connect not only physically and sexually. Connect spiritually. Connect emotionally. Um be aligned with one another be super in tune with one another okay become one you know so definitely take your time so do not rush things when this when this comes in uh for you because you don't want to miss 
Uh, you don't want to miss anything, and you you don't want to miss anything that's you know beautiful. Um, two as well. Uh, we're going to end this with some. I guess we're going to end this with some affirmations that you can say to yourself um, and some music here. Okay, can we get some affirmations for the Pisces, please? Affirmations for the Pisces, please. Okay, it says here, I am infinite, so you are infinite, but you can't put no cap on you, you are infinite and, uh, and abundant, okay? Uh, it says I am balanced, okay? So you are balanced. Okay, it says here, I am growing. I am glowing. Okay, so you shot. Listen, I shine. That's it. That's the affirmation, honey. You glowing. It says here, I am intelligent. So you're very smart. It says, I am overcoming. Okay, here you had to overcome a lot. Uh, it says here, I am a teacher. Okay, so here you had to overcome a lot. And now that you had to overcome a lot, um, you're being blessed to be in, to be able to uh, teach others around you, okay? This is what this was for. All that you went through and all that you had to leave in the past, it wasn't for no reason. Uh, you were being called to help and assist, okay? It says here, I am uh, ambitious, okay? So, yes. They gonna love me for my ambition, okay? I hear Wale, okay? So just keep it up and keep going. Can we get a song that may resonate? Okay, we got a couple. Okay, we got we got Cali Usage, Loner. Okay, so you could be a loner. We got Ken the Man, Gimme That. Okay, we got Mary Jane Girls All Night Long. We got Little Sims featuring Cleo Soul Woman. We have Any and Georgia Smith King Black Girls Remix. You know, I got to give y'all a little playlist to go and listen to. We got Megan Thee Stallion, Cocky as F. So listen, you got every right to be cocky. Okay. Okay. Oh, listen, I'm taking this. Okay, this is at the bottom of the deck, okay? We got Tupac, all eyes on me. So listen, all eyes on you. We got Trill Fam, Ducked Off. So you could be ducked off to yourself as well. And go and listen to these songs because it could be a message within uh, the song or it could be something within the song title that could resonate with you, okay? So again, we got Trill Fam, Ducked Off. We got Tupac, All Eyes on Me. We got Ken the Man, Give Me That. We got Drew Hill, Beauty. So listen, this is out here. Three, You are a true beauty. And if you ever doubt that, stop. Do not doubt that. We got Drew Hill, Beauty. I am beautiful. True beauty. Do you know how truly beautiful and amazing you are? Okay, triple threat. A lot of stuff is repeating out here. Triple threat. I see why they talking. We got here Megan Thee Stallion, cocky as F, okay? We got Enna and Georgia Smith, Ping, Black Girls Remix. We got Mary Jane, Girls, 
all night long, okay, old school, old school, you can have you an old soul, we got Cali Usage, Loner, okay, and then we got Little Sims featuring Cleo Soul Woman, so go and definitely listen to those songs, okay, so you can receive those messages, okay, um, Oh, that's what I wanted to see. Now, before I end it, I know I said I was ending it with the affirmations and the music. But, we always have work to do. So, I'm going to end it with a soul truth card that you can go um, and journal. Because um, journaling is also important. Okay? And no matter how far we reach, there is always still some work to do as well. Okay? So can we get a soul truth message here a message here for the Pisces, please? Can we get a Okay. So we have here, does my life have room for more pleasure in play? Okay? So listen. And I'm just sitting up here talking about more work to do. Da, da, da. Oh no, they like girl, shut up. <laughs> All this work that you done already put in. Uh-uh, shut up. Play a little bit. <laughs> Have some pleasure, okay? So listen. This is some work for you to do, okay? Journal, okay? Journal and see how you can make more room for you to have pleasure and play more. So that, you know, you can enjoy the fruits of your labor. Because that's a lot of work and a lot of things to overcome here. Um, I didn't really go into, you know what? You know what? This is about to be a little bit longer. Because we're going to try to see. Even though, you know, you know you've been through a lot. But we're going to do, we're going to pull some random messages um, as well. Just to see. You know, some of the things that you may have had to overcome, too. Uh, just not only, you know, fighting the negativity within yourself and within other people. We're going to get, like, a little bit more pacific, okay? Um, but, yeah, okay? So, make you a journal. See what you can do to enjoy yourself more. Play a little bit. Have some pleasure. Listen, that's funny. they like, girl, work. That's funny. <laughs> They like, girl, work if you don't have you some fun. Okay, so listen, even through all of the healing that you do and everything, um, you have to take some time out to uh, enjoy uh, your leveling up, okay? Don't rob yourself of that. Uh, we have here, in what area are you lacking pleasure right now? Maybe in certain relationships or with work. Is it possible to shift the seriousness of life to experiencing a more creative, wild, and playful side of you, okay? So, not so serious. <laughs> okay, so then we have here, the sole action that you can take uh, today, you know, and these are some more questions. It's like a, quite a few questions for you, so you can have you a nice little journal, um... You could have you a nice little journal here. So, again, I'm going to read the questions over again. It says here, does my life have room for more pleasure in play? Next question, in what area are you lacking pleasure right now? Next question, maybe in certain relationships or with work. Is that where it's lacking? Okay. And then it says here, is it possible to shift the seriousness of life to experiencing a more creative, wild, and playful side of you? Okay, so those are four questions so far. And then we have here two more questions. What would happen if you added more play and laughter into your life? Okay, ask yourself that. And an answer for me, what I have for you, for my um, knowledge and experience is you will raise your vibration to one of the highest one of the highest uh, vibrations being happy um, and being joyful um, and you will attract so much then we have here what area 
is lacking this right now. So figure out what area is lacking pleasure or play within you, okay? And it says here, take time to play. Let go of any need to produce anything. So don't force it, okay? Just play with it and enjoy, okay? Ooh. Just play with it and enjoy. Okay, we're going to get some random messages here. And then after these random messages, we're going to end it with a grateful heart message. take the ones that turned over yep I'll take the ones that turned over and okay those are the ones that turned over let's see Let's get some more random messages, please, for the Pisces. Okay, we're going to drop that. Okay. Any more? That's too many. Any more random messages here for... Any more random messages here for the Pisces, please? They like, girl. <laughs> I don't care if it's a lot popping out. Read what I got popping out. Okay. Okay. So we have here, since this is uh, one that's turned over with a message here. Uh, dance and raise the vibration so you need to move around and dance okay and we're gonna see what these random messages is okay see what you had to overcome okay it says here slay slay these dragons these in -in, these in -in, these ninjas and your goals okay so it's time for you to slay everything okay but take your time we have here beat it get ghosts so you may have to tell some people to beat it you had to get ghosts again uh the song loner did come out as a song and also ducked off came out as a song okay so you had to do you had to do what you had to do okay it says looks like your future is going to be bright okay so you have some things to look forward to Okay, shit was too messy for you, okay? So people were being very messy. You had to overcome that. You had to believe what you were being shown instead of believing what you wanted to believe about certain individuals, okay? And it, when you started to believe that, you started to focus on yourself, okay? Okay, know that better days are coming, okay? You were in the way, okay? You need daily bread, okay? Uh, you could be uh, nonchalant right now. People could have act nonchalant towards you here. But you're definitely the main topic because you are amazing, okay? You, If you do get dreams, okay, answers come to you in your dreams. You can have psychic dreams here, okay? Get back in your heart and follow it, okay? And, ooh, that goes back to what I was saying earlier with... Um, goes back to what I was saying earlier about this healing card. You see how she had her hand over her heart. So definitely focus on your um focus on your heart chakra, okay? We have no here, okay? Yeah. You definitely still need to um work on your heart chakra more, okay? Because I'm seeing, no, you were not in your heart. So it's time for you to get back in your heart and follow it, okay? Because you are becoming, okay? Uh, getting rid of illusions here, okay? So you're seeing through, 
okay you could be a student you could be studying okay studying things you know people are sneak dissing you okay because you a good influence okay and they mad because they're not we have get out the way yeah you had to get out the way because you were in your you were in your way and you also had to get out the way of these people so they can get whatever they got coming to them we got here you could be a bbw okay know that you're gorgeous you're pressure you're wonderful uh and whatever rose you got they hawaiian rose they not regular and you ain't no regular beauty okay these people envy you okay a whole lot of envy okay um shoot your soulmate could be a you could be a thick fine fine ass man honey or your soulmate could be a thick fine ass man okay somebody sorry or a thick fine ass man could be sorry okay or your shady friends could be sorry and it says danger okay so be careful about who you got around you and them so-called friends you got because they mad they're average okay it says here yeah follow so they could be following you meanwhile you're um on a different path following what you're meant to do in your own path so continue to follow that these people could be following you being shady okay but lead a path in the past because that's where they belong right behind you okay we you could be a tall stallion okay um okay and again no need to worry or stress any of this because you have a savior and that is Joshua. and you know what that came out in the letters to you too honey about connecting with here we go right here you gotta save your baby so you don't need to stress or worry about nothing because you have a savior you will be saved you are protected in all that you do so keep going keep being a light keep moving forward uh never mind this jealousy this envy um and hate it doesn't matter okay it is above you okay and if somebody comes to you with it be like it's all above me now <laughs> okay you can have an initial i k o j i v q w q s v p p x h i t u s g c p b J E A H K P V E U. Okay, those could be uh, initial. Okay, and let's get a grateful heart message and go on and close this reading out. Can I get a grateful heart message, please, for the Pisces? Can I get a grateful heart message one at a time? Oh, well, you know what? Nope, I'm an eagle. Can I get a grateful heart message, please, here? For the Pisces. Now, these is a lot. But I'm going to go on and tackle them. I'm going to go on and tackle them, okay? We have some grateful heart messages for you, Pisces. We have here, may you be blessed by Yahweh, the maker of heaven and earth. So know you is blessed, okay? That then came out. Great is our Yahweh. His understanding is infinite, okay? Yahweh sustains the humble, okay? We have the heavens declare the glory of Yahweh. You go before me and follow me. You place your hand of blessings on my head, okay? <clears throat> we have here, from the fullness of his grace, we have all received one blessing after another. Okay, we have here, never lose an opportunity of seeing anything that is beautiful. For beauty is Yahweh's handwriting. 
a wayside sacrament welcome it in every fair face in every fair sky in every fair flower and thank Yahweh for it is a ble a cup of blessing okay you prepare a feast for me in the presence of my enemies you honor me by anointing my head with oil my cup runneth over with blessings okay hallelujah and that's why I'm saying don't worry about these people because you got a savior, honey, okay? And the table shall be formed in the face of your enemies. We have here rejoice in Yahweh and be glad, okay? Those who bring sunshine into the lives of others, the lives of others cannot keep it from themselves. So that goes back to what I was telling you earlier about how beautiful you are. And do you truly know? Okay, and also you really shine, okay, and you are a healer, you have a beautiful aura, um, and that's why you had to be a loner and duck off and tune in to yourself and hone into yourself, because what good is it you giving all of this beauty to everybody, but you starving yourself of it? It says here, for I know the plans I have for you, declares Yahweh, plans for welfare and not for evil. To give you a future and a hope. Okay? We have here, as we express our gratitude, we must never forget that the highest appreciation is not to utter words, but to live by them. Thank you for making me so wonderfully complex. Your workmanship is marvelous. How well I know it. In me, you may have peace. In the world, you will have tribulation. But be good of cheer. I have overcome the world. Okay. So again, that just talks about you again. Not having nothing to worry about. It's coming out over and over and over again. And yeah, we have things to heal from. And we go through things through this life to to learn and, and, and to ascend. Okay. But don't worry because you still have a savior for all the things that you go through. You're not alone. Even though you may be a loner, you're not alone. And you probably do know that, you know? That's why you're tuned in and connected. Okay? So we have here, give thanks to Yahweh for his unfailing love and his wonderful deeds for mankind. The best things are nearest. Breathe in your nostrils. Light up. <laughs> Breath in your nostrils. Light in your eyes flowers at your feet, duties at your hands, the path of Yahweh just before you. So yeah, you have you have a purpose and a and a path to um to be on. Okay, it says here, it is Yahweh who arms me with strength and makes my way perfect. I love you, O oh, Yahweh my strength. Okay, it says here, I will give you thanks for you answered me. You have become my salvation. Happiness is itself a kind of gratitude, okay? Again, like I told you, being happy is one of the highest forms of vibration. Get into it. Get into it. Okay? He who dwells in the shelter of the Most High will rest in the shadow of the Almighty, okay? You can hear sirens a lot or you can see 911 a lot, okay? And when you see that, go read Psalms 91. Okay, know that you are protected and you are safe. You got to say, listen, it came out at again and again and again. It says here, Yahweh holds the hands of his people. Okay, and then we have here, every good and perfect gift is from above, coming from the father of the heavenly lights. Okay, so you got your gifts and everything has been stowed upon you from the most high. Okay, he got you. It says, keep your face to the sunshine, and you cannot see a shadow. We have here, call upon me in the day of trouble. I will deliver you, and you shall glorify me. The words of Yahweh are pure, okay? Yahweh will meet all your needs according to the riches of his glory in Yahshua. Then we have here, uh, Yahweh crowns you with love and mercy, a paradise crown. He wraps you in goodness, in, in goodness, beauty internal. So you're beautiful inside and out. 
And like I said, it came up three times, triple threat. In threes, signify you being aligned to mind, body, soul. We have here the blessing of, of Yahweh be upon you, okay? So you're very blessed. You're big blessed, okay? Beyond blessed, okay? It says here, Yahweh will guide you always. So you get your guidance and you're connected. <laughs> Plain as day right up and through here to the most high. And listen, you got something to rejoice in and to be happy about, okay? Block out, continue to block out that negativity, okay? Um, thank you for listening. I love you. I hope you all got a message here from this reading. Okay, continue to thrive and push forward. Again, I love you. Blessings to you all. Have a wonderful day.